Hi friends, what's so This is our key from 360 Reader. It's time to talk about the three quick ways to delete Safari website data on iPhone and iPad. For a more personalized experience, Safari automatically saves your website data. Hence, you can quickly log in to websites and access the preferred data without having to input the login credentials repeatedly. Though it's aimed at enhancing the browsing experience, you should delete Safari website data on your iPhone or iPad from time to time in order to keep the clutter at bay. Apart from retrieving some precious stories, it can also safeguard your privacy and even help you speed up Safari. On this very note, let's find out the quick ways to delete Safari website data on iPhone and iPad. Before getting started, make sure you have subscribed our YouTube channel and hit the bell icon so that you won't miss any update from 360 Reader. First off, I'm going to show you how to delete specific Safari website data on your iPhone or iPad. To get it started, open the Settings app on your device, then scroll down to find Safari and select it. After that, head over to the bottom of the screen and choose Advanced. Then tap on Website Data. On the next screen, you should see a long list of website data. To access all the data, tap on Show All Sites along the bottom of the screen. Then tap on the Edit button at the top right corner of the screen. After that, tap on the red minus button to the left of a specific website data and hit delete. In the end, make sure to tap on done at the top right corner to confirm the action and you are good to go. So that's how you can easily delete a specific website data in Safari on your iOS or iPadOS device. Next up, I'm going to show you how to remove all Safari website data on iPhone and iPad. To do so, open the Settings app on your device and then find Safari and select it. Then tap on Advanced that is located at the bottom of the screen. Then tap on Website Data. Then hit Remove All Website Data. Next, a pop-up menu will appear from the bottom of the screen saying this will clear data that could be used for tracking but is also used by websites to preserve login information to speed up browsing. Make sure to tap on Remove now to confirm the action. Finally, I'm going to show you how to clear all Safari website data along with browsing history on your iPhone and iPad. Should you need to erase everything including cookies, browsing history, and website data, there is a pretty easy way to get it done as well. To do so, open the Settings app on your iPhone or iPad. After that, scroll down and tap on Safari. Then tap on Clear History and Website Data. Now a pop-up will show from the bottom of the screen saying Clearing will remove history, cookies and other browsing data. Make sure to tap on Clear History and Data to confirm the action and you are good to go. That's pretty much it. So that's how you can easily delete Safari website data on your iPhone or iPad. Now that you know how it works, make the most tough way to speed up Safari and also keep the clutter at bay. If you found this video helpful, do like and share it and I'll see you in the next video with more such handy iPhone and iPad hacks. Till then, stay safe and have a great time. Bye-bye.